Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Raven and I'm your Pilates instructor today. I teach bar, I teach ballet, I teach Pilates, and today we're gonna be doing a combination of all of those. So all you need today is your mat. We're gonna be doing a lower body basics workout. So you're gonna get everything you need to make sure you've got strong legs, strong inner thighs, flexible hips, and you're just feeling juicy and good. So once you got your gear, I even got a little bit of coffee right here. We're gonna get this party started. Here we go, baby. Alrighty, everyone, let's come to lying down on your backs. Your feet are directly underneath your knees. So heels under knees, feet about hip distance apart. Arms are pushed into the mat. We're starting with a hinge bridge. So in one piece, lift your hips up by squeezing your butt and then lower down. Keep that going. A lift and a lower and push. So make sure you're not using your lower back here. Everything goes up in one piece, down. I want you to think about pushing from your booty and stretching the fronts of your hips. Arms are digging into the mat. We've got three. Ooh, squeeze your bit. We've got two. Oh boy. Okay, now hold it up. We go halfway, down an inch, up down an inch, squeeze, lift. Pulling the belly button into the spine, pushing the arms into the mat. Keep going, lower half and lift. By not going all the way down, we're increasing the time under tension, baby. I'm really starting to feel my glutes. For three, two more. How are you breathing? Last one, hold it up at the top. Imagine two strings on your hip bones. Can you snip your left string, right hip stays still, push it back up, same side, lower. Lift. I love this exercise, because it's really like we're working single leg, but we're not. We still got the support of both legs. And lift, and lower. Keep that right side active and push, think about pushing up with that left glute. One more, you'll feel your waist work a little too. Okay, eight times other side, eight, push. Seven, I think about like spilling water out of my right hip, Ooh, It's gonna feel a little different on one side, that's totally okay. Oh my gosh, my booty is already burning, y'all. <laughs> what? Five, relax the neck and chest, use your arms. Almost there. Last one, eight, hold it, roll all the way down. Woo, I'm feeling it burning. Okay, let's do more single leg work. Hold your hips up, just your right foot. Taps out, taps in, taps out, taps in. If you've got on a slippery little sock or your mat is slippery, you can even kind of shave your heel out. But it's a real small movement and I want you to keep everything else as still as possible. Woo. You see how my right hip wants to fall down, try not to let it. <sighs> Two more, make sure you're breathing, it's burning. <laughs> One more. Okay, other side, eight times, eight. <sighs> keep everything still. Six, you're gonna feel your abs and your waist have to work here too. Woo. <sighs> Four more. And three, I don't care how high your hips are. Two, and one, let's alternate, here we go. Eight, seven, it's a small little step. Kind of like you're playing like, what's that tap game where you gotta like tap the dot, tap the dot. <laughs> Do y'all remember that game where it's like, twist it, jab it, poke it. <laughs> it's so dramatic, but I really liked that game. I'm really old. <laughs> one more set. Ooh. Okay, roll down. Pull your knees into your chest. Give yourself a little break. My booty is literally on fire. We got one more. 
same position, honey bunny. <sighs> Arms push to mat, hips lift up, we hold it. Now, just your right foot goes out an inch, then your left foot, then your right foot, then your left foot. It's a march. We go out, out, in, in. That's one. Out, out, in, in. Ooh, we got one more leading with this right foot. Okay, now hold it here, lead with your left foot. Four times, go, out, out, in, in. Woo, I feel it. Out, out, in, in, two more. Out, out, in, in, one more. Out, out, in, in, hold it. Roll your body down, pull yourself all the way in. Oh my God. Okay, rock yourself up. Flip over and come to your forearm facing wall. So my kneecaps are facing you, legs are bent, abs are in and up. We've got one of our favorites here, clamshells. If you decide you wanna to advance today, you could totally be wearing some ankle weights or even a resistance band above your knees, but why? <laughs> So I really want you to start to warm up the outside of this right hip. Try not to collapse into your lower body at all. Whew. Boy, it's gonna start to work, I promise. <laughs> now let's add on knee to knee. We lift the right foot and then we go back to open. Knee to knee. So you're gonna feel the inside of your hip work too for a little bit of internal rotation. Might even feel your waist work. If you want to advance more, both ankles come up. Let's do eight of those. Whew. Seven. Ooh. Six. Five. Imagine you have like a little baby beach ball underneath this left rib and you don't want to squish it. Ew, I even feel that bottom leg. Seven. Last one, eight, go back to your clamshells for eight, seven, breathing, six, we're almost there y'all, five, and four, three, it's a beautiful day, two, <laughs> now hold it up right here, this is our new home position, my feet are together, my little toes are pointed, my knee is up to the ceiling, extend, bend, one, and two, Try not to let this top hip go backwards. Keep it forward. I don't care how big you make it. Three. Try not to collapse, right? If you need to, lay all the way down. Four. Ooh, it's hard work. Five. My leg doesn't go too high. That's okay. Six. Seven. Last one. Hold it. Lower that leg all the way down straight. Extend both legs out straight and lay your body down. Beautiful. See how I've got a nice little uh, V shape with my legs. Abs are in. Can you lift both legs and lower? <sighs> Think about working from your waist again. So I know we're working lower body, but especially for sideline, you should be working your whole body, you guys. Your whole body, yaddy, yaddy, yaddy. Hold this up. Now, keep your bottom left leg there. Can top leg lift lower? Woo! I don't care how, how it goes. And check it out, my bottom leg is still there. Abs are running up. Four. And five. Keep that bottom leg lifted, baby. Keep the hips stacked. Woo! Good for hip mobility. Seven. Woo! Eight, hold it, squeeze these legs together. Now both legs go open a little, close one. Now we're getting inner thighs, two, three. It's like a little alligator chomp, four. You'll feel waist working too. Woo, seven, eight. Let's do eight more here. One, use your stomach to help you do it. You can always lay all the way down, four. Five, squeeze your booty. Six, seven. Let's do one more round, you got it. One, two, you're gonna feel your top hip working too. Three, don't forget about that bottom leg. Both legs go like an alligator, like a clap. Make a clap. I'm so musical today. Three more, three, two, Hold these legs together, hold them tight, little baby beats. In, 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 in. Both legs working, do not forget about that bottom leg. Woo! 
almost there y'all. Eight more times, go eight, seven, six, Keep your legs up. We got four, three, two, hold it on one. Lower that thing down. Oh my gosh. All right, bring it up. Flip your legs around to the other side. Let's immediately go to the other side because we are gonna finish with some quadruped. Okay, my right elbow. Here we go, clamshells open and close. This is a great time for a little coffee break. <laughs> That's why I love Pilates. You can drink coffee. <laughs> Ugh, caffeinated baddies only. No, I'm just kidding. So aggressive today. I really have a lot of energy. <laughs> Ooh. Big squeeze back here. Big squeeze back here. For three, abs are in and up. Two. Now let's add on knee to knee. We go, just that top leg. If anything, you can let your top hip travel forward just a few inches. Let it travel forward a little. Open, let it travel forward. One more here, then we got our big advancement. Here we go, both ankles. I feel lots of upper body happening. Abs in and up. Big twist. Big twist. Woo, honey child, boo boo. Man, it feels so good in the neighborhood. <laughs> you can do it, honey. Mm. Open. And mm. Eh. Let's go a five. Woo. Let's go a four. Woo. Let's go a three. Woo. Let's go a two. One more, honey boo boo child. Why does my mom always call me that? No, hold it. Remember, we got our feet together. Knee up to the ceiling, other one pushing into the mat. Here we go, one. Try not to sink down. This is where it's gonna be hard. I do not care how high your leg goes. Four, five, we're kind of working inner thigh right here and your glutes, six, seven, last one, hold it up on eight, lower that leg down, both legs lower down. We lay all the way down, make sure your body is in a long line, hips are stacked, both legs lift, lower, lift, I don't care how high they go, as long as you're not wiggling around. You should really feel your sides help you out here too. Ooh, honey. <sighs> Two. One more. Hold it up on one. Now just your top leg lifts and lowers. Your right leg must remain still. Think about balancing your favorite cup of coffee on that bottom leg. Your favorite margarita. Skinny jalapeno marg. Tahine on the rim. There, I said it. Oh, I haven't had one of those in so long. I really feel like it's such a Texas thing. Texas has really gotten to me. Comment below what your favorite margarita is. Oh. If you haven't tried tahine on the rim, you're missing out, sunshine. Last two. Ooh, I feel my abs working on this side too. And one, now hold it. My bottom leg still has not gone down. Now we open both, close. Use your stomach and your inner thighs to help you. I'm feeling all right here. Out, in, and in, ooh, in. Two more counts of eight, here we go. Eight, seven, ooh. Six, feel like zippers between those inner thighs. Four, three, almost there. Two, try to keep that top leg up. One more set of eight, here we go. Eight, you're gonna feel your top butt cheek working too. Six, five, almost there. Four, three, Two, last one, hold it up, big squeeze. We beat our legs for 10, nine, 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more set of eight, go eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold your legs together on one, hold it, really squeeze these inner thighs, you guys, lengthen from the crown of your head to your feet, lift those legs up, oh, and lower down, okay, almost finished, all four as we go, all righty, y'all, we are on all fours, don't look at my crazy hair, <laughs> Now let's start with some cat cows just to warm up our spines. I know we've been focusing on lower body. One more time. And under. All right, find a nice neutral spine pushing through your arms. I'm gonna lift my left thigh up, tap it down. Lift. And lift. It's like I'm trying to poke my toe up to the ceiling. So now we're really getting into our glute and our hamstrings, similar muscles to our bridging muscles that we use in the beginning of class. We're kind of combining everything here. Five. Think about your kneecap pointing straight down to the mat. Whew, abs in and up. Seven. Keep your spine long and strong. Nine. 10, now let's go halfway, down and inch up, one. Ooh, if you want to flex your foot, it's actually a little bit more challenging. Think about squeezing right under where your booty meets your thigh, your thut. Six, five, four, three, two, hold it, one. Externally rotate, now your knee is pointing towards me. You go ankle to ankle, up one. Two, your hips still haven't really opened up towards me. It's how your thigh bone has externally rotated. Keep core tight. Whew. Seven. Eight. Push through the arms. Nine. Oh. Hold it halfway. Tiny. Tiny. It looks like a little attitude if you're a little ballerina. Seven. Six. Woo. Now feel it, three, two, hold it, extend the leg straight, we tap down up, we're almost there y'all, two, three, see how my spine isn't moving, I'm using my booty to do it, and my core, seven, ooh, feel lots of abs, eight, nine, last one, hold it up, tiny down and up, one, Tiny two, tiny three. Squeeze your booty. A five, oh six. Squeeze that booty, seven, and eight. Almost there, a nine, it's on fire. Hold it, 10, hold it for five, four, three, two, one. Woo! I know, I know, I know, I know. Shake it out, shake it out. Woo! Get a sip of coffee. That booty cheek's on fire. Other side, honey bunny. Nice and neutral spine, here we go. Right toe points up. I'm gonna flex my foot. Two. Keep your spine nice and long. Four. Abs in and up. Five. Push, we're opening our hips. Seven. Ooh. Eight. Ooh. Now let's go half, here we go, one. Two, use your booty. Three. Oh, keep your heel close to your tush here. It's easier if you let it go out, keep it in. Five, four, oh baby, lots of abs. Three, two, hold it up on one. Externally rotate, ankle to ankle, we go up. I can still balance a cup of coffee on my back. It's not about like a, a fire hydrant when your thigh opens to the side, right? It's just external rotation and the same thing. Open it to the back. Whew, coffee was coming up a little bit. <laughs> I swear I eat the strangest food for breakfast, y'all. It's actually so freaking weird. Like, of course I drink coffee, water. <sighs> but then I like always just like warm up leftovers. Something about the food that I ate the night before, I always want it in the morning, I don't know. I literally eat leftovers for breakfast all, like literally all the time, especially when it's Asian. It's so weird, it's, I actually, now that I think about it, I only do it with Asian food. 
I eat sushi for breakfast sometimes. <laughs> Three, if I have it left over. Two, this is actually so embarrassing. Okay, here we go, tiny. I don't know why I keep talking about food today. One, two, keep that thigh externally rotated. Three, four, use your booty. Five, six, you're gonna feel both glutes working. Seven, eight, nine, oh, it's burning. Hold it up on 10, stretch the leg. Here we go, down, up, one, down, up, two. Squeeze your butt, woo, down, up, three. Four, keep breathing. Five, oh, six, seven. Squeeze your butt back there. Eight. Now, tinies, here we go. Last 10, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. We're almost there, squeeze your booty. Four, three, two, hold it up on one. Hold it for three, two, one. Bring it in. Roll on over, cross one ankle over the opposite knee. Give yourself a big glute stretch. Woo. The higher up you sit in your spine, the bigger the stretch for three, two. Oh, switchy, switchy. Sit up tall. Ooh, baby, I feel it for three. Two. I hope you guys liked this workout. My lower body definitely feels extremely energized. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like this workout. Leave me a comment. Tell me what your favorite margarita is. And hopefully I will see you on the mat soon. We've got tons of stuff coming up. And if you want to go even deeper on your Pilates journey with me, don't forget to sign up for the Revenge Body Challenge. I've got the link down below in my description box. And regardless, I'll see you soon, baby. Peace out, Girl Scout. Uh -huh. <laughs>